Excuse me. Please. Right, well, one pint, and that's your lot. Why? Why ain't done nothing wrong? Everything all right? <laughs> Wait. It's the best day ever, Eve. <sighs> now, I spoke to Stacy. Sounds like you had a bit of a rock. Yeah. Just another person that hates me. Listen, after everything she's been through, I think she's going to be a bit sensitive about any conversations involving harassment. Do you know what I mean? Yes, but I've not harassed anyone. Everyone's just assuming that that's who I am because of my dad. Freddie, no one assumes that. Look, mate, she's been up in court against that freak and lost. So it's understandable that she's going to be a little bit sensitive about something like that. That's right, I'll, I'll go and apologise. <laughs> no. Not like that. Yeah. Forget the pint and have a coffee. How can she stomach it? Him, just there, everywhere. Just looking at us, just staring, smirking. How can she stomach it? I don't know. It takes me all my strength not to just go over there and gut that little gift. It's my fault. It's my fault if it weren't for me. Don't be stupid. Freddie, there is no one to blame but him. Oh, my head's a mess. It's my dad. He, he got in touch and I went to see him because I thought that he'd apologise, I thought that he'd say sorry, but he just... <laughs> he didn't even know why I was there. He just stood there and he blamed her. He blamed my mum. How? I was looking at him thinking, what if I'm like that? What if by science and biology I turn out the same somehow? You're not. Why get in touch? And be all matey with me and then just pretend like you've done nothing wrong. When did he get in touch? Actually out of nowhere this morning. Look. And I believed him. I genuinely thought that he was going to be straight with me. Are you sure this is from him? 